Alright everyone, welcome back to another part of my Resident Evil 4 walkthrough. What's going on? Oh my god. <coughs> oh Jesus. Yeah, I have a bit of a cold right now, so if, that, if my voice sounds a bit weird, I don't know, then that's probably why. And look at this failure right here, so... I see that I'm missing a bit of health, so I shoot that fish, right? And so I get into this uh, boat thingy, and I'm trying to come over and pick up this fish. Look at this. Look at this. I have to do, like, almost a complete, another, like, a complete other circle around it just to get to it. Yeah, and I just randomly threw a harpoon. My Moby Dick moment came over me. <laughs> and so, yeah. Right after you get out of there, if you go across the, uh, straight across the water to these blue lights, you're gonna go into this cave. And in this cave, uh, is one of the merchant's major shops. I think this is his second one. There was one way back in the other side of the lake, and there's one right here. Uh... There are actually a couple of treasures, as well you know, as, you know, items like, um, monies and, monies? <laughs> Money and ammo and stuff that you can obtain, but there's some treasures. Like, right, right off the bat there, if you take a right, break the crates, I don't know why I was shooting over there, break the crates and shoot the, um, the lantern, or the torch, I get. I don't know, I don't really know what to call it. Oh, jeez, that was a pussy, uh, that was a pussy burp. And shoot that there's a spinal on it so yeah and up here I know this might seem really stupid like why the hell are you pushing this these many boxes what the hell are in these boxes why do the why does the merchant need, need this many boxes I don't know but if you come up here in this uh, thing right here you can find a green gem and that can actually go into that face plate or the face mask thing and if you drop down right here, you get uncomfortably close to the merchant, but you can also pick up 10 rifle shells, so that's pretty, uh, <coughs> pretty useful. So, this video, I'm actually going to take a little bit to explain my life. I'm going to explain what's happening, because I've been getting a couple of, uh, messages asking where, like, videos are, right? So, I'm just going to basically, uh... Talk about my life really quick, and I'm going to uh, explain what's going on. So, right now, um, I am actually grounded. Um, my parents are not happy with my grades right now, because I have all A's except for one C in... Uh, let's. I actually don't know what I have a C in. Let me think about this for a second. <laughs> anyway, I have a C in some class, and my parents are extremely disappointed in me. And I'm like, guys, look, I have A's except for that one C. Come on now, you know, you could cut me some break, but they're like, no. So basically, every day. Uh, every weekday, let me rephrase that, every weekday, I have one hour to do whatever I want. That means I have one hour to play on the Xbox, to play on the PlayStation 2, and to play on the computer as a collective. Which means that I could divide this one hour up however evenly I want, but I only have one hour during the weekdays. And on weekends, I have two hours. So, as you, but that's two hours separately then. It's like two hours on the computer, two hours on the Xbox, two hours on PlayStation. Okay, let me quickly talk about the video. Watch this shit. Dude's, dude's having some twitches in his head. It's just like, boom, motherfucker. And then like, what, like fucking alien versus predator sprouting out of his neck like a motherfucker. But yeah, <coughs> you could kill that really quickly if you're using the Chicago typewriter. But if you don't have a Chicago typewriter, my recommendation would be using a flash grenade because flash grenades are actually, these things cannot handle light. So if you bust their head and a, and a I don't know, vagina grows out? I don't know. It looks like a uh, vagina with an eyeball and tentacles. Let's just call it an eye -gina. Yeah. If an eye spout, like, 
grows out, then you just need to throw a stun at it, and it'll, like, boom. What, stun? We're not playing Modern Warfare 2. Flash! Flash, god damn- No, not Flash! Um... No, actually, yeah, it is Flash. Oh, right here, by the way. Nice little handy-dandy trick. If you have a sniper rifle or an infinite rocket launcher. Uh -huh. <coughs> Aim down and shoot this guy, because uh, he will throw an axe at you if you go down this rope before killing him, and it's not fun. Now, I don't know what the likelihood of he'll hit he'll, him hitting you is, but you know, whatever. Uh, anyway, where was I? Oh, also, anyone who grows a virus thing, anyone who grows an Igina, I'm gonna call them a sp uh, a spouter, okay? Because I don't want to say, oh my god, a Ganado just grew a Las Pla- or just- just uh, grew a plaga, okay? It's much easier to say there's a spouter or a spouter just grew a, just grew an igina. Like that sounds fun. Like it sounds better. It sounds funnier, and it's shorter. Well, I don't know. Let me see for a second. The Ganado just grew a plaga. The spouter grew a the spout the spouter just grew a. I, well, they're, they're about the same. Okay, that's good. Aijina sounds cool, alright? Anyway. <coughs> oh, wow. We are coming to the end of this video. So, let me quickly hurry this up here. Yeah, so, grounded. Um. Don't have a lot of time, so that's why videos have not been coming constantly, but I actually made a recording session that was like 40 minutes long, and now I'm recording, and. Yeah, and the, the water wheel turns, and the gears turn, and the gates turn. Well, that actually they close, but yeah. Boom. <coughs> so yeah, that's why videos haven't been coming out. And also, I'm just like massively busy. I have like basketball conditioning and tutoring for English, even though my English teacher is like, I don't want you to come anymore. Because there's no reason, you already know how to write. And I'm like, I know, but my parents are forcing me to go because they think that I should go to every tutoring. And that's a shit ton of sp I was about to call them spouters. That's a shit ton of ganados. Or cattle. Ganado is Spanish for cattle. As if, like, everyone in the world didn't already know that. Considering that this game has been out for such a long time, but... Chicago typewriter, or the Thompson, puts a quick end to them. Speaking about Thompsons, that reminds me of World of War. What would you guys say if I put up some World of War and COD 4 multiplayer videos? Um, I, I was thinking about maybe posting up a video of uh, World of War with the DP-28. Even though everyone says that gun sucks, I think that it's a great gun. I think that it's... Spectacular. It's fabulous. No. Um. <laughs> so yeah, you can get an amber ring over there. What the, what the fuck am I doing? Oh my god. Oh, wait, hold on. I was checking my phone. That's right. Okay. Come over here and you will find this insignia. If you check it, it'll ask you to take it. Say yes. This door will open, or this stone wall will go upwards, and then Ingrid Hunnigan calls us. And says, you need to hurry the fuck up, because we need to get Ashley out of this hellhole. And, uh, that's exactly what we're gonna do. Head back to the church. Ashley's safety is our immediate priority.